Finally, the judge is back. I already know. Chat, be ready for the classic, chat. Be, be ready for the classic. Right. Is everybody ready for, for the classic? Session. Uh, who made the Ahmed the Dead terrorist reference there? Wait, say again? So, so, silence, made... I kill you. Yeah, who, who made that reference? They get, they get a plus one from me. Uh, hey, I said silence. That was Chris. Started that, that was Chris. That was Chris. Yep. Right, oh, so that's I the said... comedian dude. Oh, yeah. what is the, funny. the puppet guy or a yeah, yeah. That was that's me. That's good work. Mm -hmm. All right, very well. All right. All right, uh, court is back in session. Uh, this court has carefully reviewed the arguments and evidence presented by both the prosecution and the defense. Here we go. Uh, the defense has argued that the apprehension of the defendants and the subsequent evidence obtained should be suppressed under the fruit of the poisonous tree doctrine, uh, claiming that the excessive force was used by Officer Jack Foss during the pursuit, thus rendering the arrest and the seizure of evidence unlawful. Uh, the defense's argument hinges on the assertion that Officer Voss employed excessive force, particularly during the final moments of the pursuit when the suspect vehicle was allegedly rammed, causing it to become airborne and ultimately explode. Uh, the defense contends that this use of force was disproportionate and therefore unconstitutional, requiring the suppression of the evidence obtained as a result. Here we go, Chad. Here we go. Here However, we go. However, after a careful consideration yep. of the facts However. presented... This yep. court finds that Officer Voss was acting within reason under the circumstances. Yep, sure. Uh, the suspects sure. engage in a dangerous high speed pursuit, driving yeah, recklessly at acting. speeds exceeding 140 miles an hour, yeah. endangering public safety by driving on sidewalks, in opposing lanes, and attempting to The car doesn't jumps. go over 120. The testimony and evidence indicate that Officer Voss maintained visual contacts with the suspects throughout the pursuit, employing pit, per pit maneuvers in an effort to stop the vehicle. Uh, when the final collision did result in the, uh, while the final collision did result in the vehicle's explosion, the court finds that Officer Voss took reasonable steps to maintain a safe distance while attempting to conduct the yeah, very, and to break yeah, when necessary. Yeah. Uh, the defendants very had ample, ample opportunity to yep. yield to police lights and sirens very at reasonable. points during the pursuit, including before the final dirt path jump. The argument that the suspects were fleeing in fear from their lives from the police does not hold up, as they initiated the flight from the police long before any physical contact occurred between the vehicles. Uh, given these factors, the court finds that Officer Voss's actions were justified given the danger posed by the suspect's actions. And as such, evidence from obtained from the defendants is not suppressed as true to the poisonous tree. Now, regarding the individual charges, uh, we'll go defendant by defendant. Uh, for Mr. Dumas, on the charge of robbery of a low-security institution, uh, this court finds Mr. Dumas guilty. Uh, despite his claim that he was merely at the laundromat to wash his hoodie, uh, the evidence clearly shows that he fled from the scene in a vehicle driven by Mr. King, who was positively identified on the scene. Additionally, the possession of items commonly associated with laundromat robberies, such as the dongle and banded cash found on his person, uh, further supported the state's case. The prosecution Yo, Cabaret, the for those bits. On the charge of possession of a pharmaceutical drug without a prescription, uh, this court also finds Mr. Dumas guilty. Uh, the evidence presented, specifically the possessions of Mr. Dumas, included six painkillers found on his person, and no evidence was provided to suggest that Mr. Dumas has a valid prescription for these drugs. And finally, on the charge of criminal possession of a firearm class one, uh, this court finds Mr. Dumas guilty. Uh, the de evidence shows that Mr. Dumas was in the possession of an M1911 pistol that was not registered to him, and he does not possess a valid weapons license. Uh, for Chris King, on the charge of robbery of a low security that, institution, uh, this court finds Mr. King guilty. Uh, he was positively identified on scene after removing his mask and was the driver of the getaway vehicle. Additionally, banded cash commonly associated with the laundromat robberies was found on his person at the time of arrest. Uh, uh, the prosecution has proven this charge beyond a reasonable doubt. And then on the charge of criminal possession of a government-issued dangerous and or combat purpose equipment, uh, this court also finds Mr. King guilty. Uh, Mr. A possession photos show that Mr. King had chest armor on his person, uh, which was confirmed to be police-issued armor uh, when Mr. Shiesty brought the piece of evidence from the evidence locker and showed it to my person. Uh, as it is police-issued armor, that falls under the definition of the charge of possession of government-issued uh, dangerous and or combat. This is why, this equipment. is why, Pete, you got to just go full tryhard and, and do jobs with one, uh, the sports court cars Mr. King guilty, uh, and just highway Dumas blast. It shows that Mr. King was in possession of a firearm without a valid license. After today, we go full tryhard. Finally, on the charge of possession of a pharmaceutical drug without a prescription, uh, like Mr. Dumas, uh, this court finds Mr. King guilty. Uh, the evidence, again, shows that Mr. King was in possession of pharmaceutical drugs, specifically painkillers, without a valid prescription. So in summary, the court finds both defendants guilty on all charges. Uh, the evidence presented has been sufficient to prove these charges beyond a reasonable doubt, and the argument of excessive force leading to the suppression of evidence is not enough under the fact. That is the order of the case. How's the uh, how's aspirin? Mm. Yes, they wait for wait, the house of an aspirin. Your Honor, That's Your Honor, can right. I ask you a question? Yes, your Honor, you can. Can you come here? Oh. How's how's uh, how's uh, aspirin, uh, which is a painkiller, uh, like illegal? 
So uh, under the new Good. drugs scheduling legislation, oh, okay. uh, that is... Also, fuck you. Yeah. Sorry, I had to do it. Okay. Oh. I'll go oh to jail now. Why Judge! Would you, why? Yeah, I don't why? give a fuck. Fuck why? that guy. He got, he got close enough to my fucking shit. Oh I'm going God. to jail. I'm fucking going to jail the right... No, no, no. You're charging him. Come no, here. Wait. Come, come, come here. Come here. Come here. Let's get out of here. Fuck your shit! Yeah. No, I don't give a fuck! Yeah. Okay, what, 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 fucking A! A fucking man! Come down! Got him in cuffs. Fucking shit! Alright, now I surrender. Got him in cuffs. Holy shit, this system is cooked. Jack, you a fucking idiot, bro. Literally ran the <laughs> fuck out of us. Sent us flying into the air and we blew up because of it. You a fucking <laughs> idiot, Jack. Peanut, 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 you a fucking brother. brain dead. You, you went in there and says, yes, your honor, I was at the laundromat. Blow, blow. Come on. Like, Denzel, Denzel. Denzel, Denzel. This is how I know you brain dead because you don't understand what food of the poisonous tree is, you fucking <laughs> idiot. <laughs> Holy <laughs> fuck, you brain dead. Holy fuck, you brain dead. Yep, I was at I was at the laundromat washing my clothes and drying it. All right. <laughs> 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 oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, what? You can't run, do you? <laughs> Bitch, hey, hey, you took the cuffs off. I fuck, hey, I. Fuck. <laughs> Such an idiot, bro. I'm so fucked. There's no hiding spots. What is this? Oh God. 